Elijah was a wilderness man with a message from God to bring. His eyes were glistening with the power of the Lord as he stood in the face of the king. Said, As the Lord God of Israel, before whom I stand, said, Rain nor dew shall not fall till I give a command, until I give a command. God called on Elisha with twelve yoke of oxen he plowed. He cried, My father, the horseman thereof, and the chariot of Israel. So he took up the prophet's mantle, and he walked to the Jordan side. And he cried, Where is the God of Elijah? And the bed of the river went dry. I said, The bed of the river went dry. So when the world gets all mixed up with civilization plans With their scientific knowledge Depending on the wisdom of man God always sends Elijah when he needs a real true man God always has confidence when he calls on a wilderness man Now before the Messiah's coming A forerunner was to come so out of the wilderness stomped the man who said his name was John. He was wrapped up in a camel skin, wild honey and locusts he ate. But he filled every valley and he flattened every hill and he made every crooked thing straight. Made every crooked thing straight. So when the world gets all mixed up with civilization plans, with their scientific knowledge, Depend him on the wisdom of man. God always sends Elijah when he needs a real true man. God always has confidence when he calls on a wilderness man. Behold, I send you Elijah before the dreadful day. In the days of the voice when the seventh angel sounds, you better listen to what he has to say. You'll not be what you imagine, a smart, educated man. So pay attention to God's holy word, for he'll be a wilderness man. So when the world gets all mixed up, civilization plans. With their scientific knowledge, depend on the wisdom of man. God always sends Elijah when he needs a real true man. God always has confidence when he calls on a wilderness man, when he calls on a wilderness man.